October 28, Monday, Feast of St. Simon and Jude Apostles, a reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Luke. When Jesus went up the mountain to pray, and he spent the night in prayer to God, when day came, he called his disciples to himself, and from them he chose twelve whom he also named apostles, Simon, whom he named Peter, and his brother Andrew, James, John, Philip, Bartholomew, Matthew, Thomas, James the son of Alphaeus, Simon who was called a Zealot, and Judas the son of James, and Judas Iscariot who became a traitor. The Gospel of the Lord He spent the night in prayer. Jesus prays the whole night before he chooses the twelve apostles out of the many disciples following him. All alone, he prays to God for guidance and enlightenment for a very important decision. Luke presents Jesus as praying a number of times. His gospel has been dubbed as the gospel of prayer. When day comes from the many disciples, Jesus singles out twelve men to be apostles. They are then sent on a mission. Jesus empowers them to preach, to heal, and to exercise demons. Every spiritual leader must take time to pray privately. He should pray especially before he makes a controversial decision. His decision must be based on God's will and not on his own whims, biases, and caprices. He must also be careful to choose his companions in the ministry. They are not there to give him comfort, but to keep him well informed. They must be willing to be sent, to be on their own. Those who are chosen to collaborate must also learn how to pray. The apostles ask, Lord, teach us to pray. The pastor must be prepared to accept the reality that one from the ranks may betray him like Judas Iscariot, making money at the expense of the church.